streets, into beats, into a food truck festival with WCOI and Town Square Media. It's open to the public, it's 21 plus because there will be some faces there, there will be beer, so uh, you need to be 21. But get over to WCOI.com to sign up for tickets, you know, 10 bucks in advance, okay? And some great food trucks like this one here on May 3rd, alright? So here's what we're going to do, we're going to step inside the food truck, we're going to talk to April and the crew, we're going to get to see and smell a little bit more of the beautiful stuff that's going on in there. We love food trucks, we love our food here in downtown Portland, so let's go check it out. Alright, let's go inside and see what everything's about. Hello, Hi. how are you? This is Joe. Thank Welcome you. to our humble little kitchen. Rosaline. Rosaline. Rosaline, Joe, April right over here. Wow, it smells and feels nice in here. Yeah, especially in the wintertime. Oh, I can imagine. What do you got going on here? Uh, we got some uh, carnitas, which is uh, which is a braised pork. Yep. And then what I do is I crisp them up a bit. And uh, this, we're filling this uh, order, which is uh, a carnitas burrito, which is going to take, of course, the meat. And then it's going to take uh, a little bit of cheese here. It goes all weekend. And then Rosalina's gonna finish it off with uh, guacamole, sour cream, and uh, house sauce, homemade sauce. How long have you guys been based out of the truck here? Uh, May 5th, Cinco de Mayo. Yep. Will be our first year anniversary. Good first year? Excellent first year. Yeah. Uh, we've been very fortunate. Yep. And uh, since day one, it's just been. Uh, it's been going crazy. Portland loves its food. Yeah, yeah. And uh, uh, April's from uh, the Los Angeles area. I'm from, okay. I'm from Arizona. Well, my mom's uh, originally from Mexico. Yep. So uh, uh, I learned a lot from her and my grandmother. Well, it's nice to hear things are going good here because people around here, they definitely know burritos, they know tacos very well, so. Uh, and we do run, uh, we run specials uh, periodically. What's your favorite item on the menu? Uh, mine personally, I would have to say the, uh, boy, I would have to say the beef taquitos, which are rolled tacos. Okay. And uh, we, uh, I like the beef. We make uh, chicken, we make beef. Uh, potato and juice. Okay. And uh, April's in charge of making those. Ah, all right. So uh, she's not up there all quiet, but she she's a big part of this. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah she is. <laughs> she does a lot of the planning, um, our scheduling, and uh, she handles the tequilos and all the uh, agua fresca, the water that we have. Yep. And I handle pretty much everything else in the menu. Well, we're looking forward to having you guys uh, out on May 3rd at our uh, food truck festival. And a lot of people love you guys, so I think you're going to be uh, one of the popular ones out there, for sure. We're, we're looking forward to it. Well, we're outside of El Corazon, the food truck uh, extraordinaire, Mexican food from the heart. And Tim and Sandy are here, and they eat here uh, on occasion. Yeah, I mean, I really think it's, actually, to be honest with you, I feel like it's the best Mexican food that you can get in, in the whole city. Uh, and you know, I've been to some of the brick and mortar places, but this 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 will uh, compete with any one of them. So I think it's pretty good. What about you? Do you like it? Yeah. It's a food truck festival. It's going to be a great time. Lots of different types of food. You can find out more at wcoy.com. Get your tickets ahead of time. Twenty-one plus because there will be beer there. All right? The first thousand people that are in get a free commemorative beer pint glass. So that's a pretty cool deal. So make sure you get there early. Try all the food, it's fantastic. With our good friend at El Corazon, we want to thank them very much for lunch today and a good time. See them there on May 3rd with WCBY and Town Square Media. And remember, to know how to eat is to know enough. That's great.